Hi, thank you for joining my channel today. My name is Jay Renee, and I am so happy that you are here today. Um, I wanna talk to you today about um, what you need or what uh, you desire, or, or do you even know what you need or you uh, like? Uh, so many times um, we put everyone before us and uh, we forget about us and what we like and what we need we put uh, might put your husband first uh, your friendships your relationship your children um, someone might have uh, gotten sick in your family if you had to take care of them you might be a caretaker um, and you have put them first but today I just want to ask the question uh, what do you like what do you need uh, in your life uh, do you know what type of food you like do you know what type of movies you like uh, do you not know what type of clothing you like um, do you want to change your style of clothing uh, do you know um, anything about yourself on the inside uh, as far as what you like and what you would love to do or the changes that you have made? Have you even thought about uh, those changes? Uh, when we put our, our husbands, our friends, our family, our children, uh, first we forget about ourselves. We uh, put all of our love and our care, and that's fine. We are supposed to love them. We are supposed to care for them. We are supposed to be helpmeets. We're supposed to have great relationships. Um, but are you taking care of you? Are you taking care of yourself and your needs and your wants? Have you had a chance to even write it down on paper? Um, have you had a chance to think about it? Um, I just believe that this time that we're going through, this is our time to really, uh, these last couple of months is really readjust ourselves and really get in tune with ourselves as far as um, what is the next steps. Uh, if we have, if someone has just been sitting around watching TV or, and I'm not saying, excuse me, I'm not saying that you can't watch TV, you can't do any of those things, but have you poured into yourself? Have you poured in to what you want um, for this next season that's coming up for this time? Have you gotten in things into place? Do you want to start a business? Do you want to start a hobby? What do you want to do? What do you like? Um, I had to figure out the things that I like. Uh, the things that I didn't like. Have you figured that out? Have you figured out some things that you just will not allow to happen again? You just will not allow um, someone to do to you again or even doing it to yourself. Um, not even playing the blame game, but um, realizing what has taken place in your life over the last several years or the last several months or the last couple of months or um, it might have been 30 years ago. Um, something that you're willing to change that has not been working in your life. Uh, are you ready to do that or have you been doing it? Um, have you started uh, like I said, writing it down and coming to grips that certain things need to change uh, in your life. Um, have you done some adjustments? Um, have you gotten uh, real with yourself uh, to stop putting everybody before you, but to truly love you, to truly uh, figure out? You might have to um, eat all types of food to find out what you like. Um, that has happened uh, before that um, you don't even know what you like. So you like, okay, do I like Italian? Uh, do I like seafood? Do I like Chinese food? Uh, do I like barbecue? You know, um, you might just feel like you have been a robot and just 
doing things uh, with other people or for other people or just adjusting to what they like that you have put yourself on the back burner. It's time to uh, come out of that. Um, it's time to uh, readjust some things in your life and really figure out um, what's best for you. What What is best for you? Um, I know uh, some uh, women have put so much in their children and their children grow up and they go to school and they go off to work or whatever and they're living their lives and they're sitting there like, okay, what, what's next? Like, who am I? <laughs> Where did I come from? You know, you have all these um, questions in your mind because you never had a life when they had a life. Uh, you never um, got to know the fullness of you once you had children and once they... Uh, go off to live their lives and so it's just different things um, that has taken place and so I really would like to know uh, what do you like what do you want write down in the comment section um, if you if you don't know you don't know if you're just becoming uh, to recognize that you don't know you can write that as well, um, but write it in the comment section. I would love to know where you are right now in the place that you are right now. And this is a safe zone. This is a safe place uh, where we can communicate and dialogue with each other. Um, this is a place uh, that there's no judgment. This is no judgment uh, zone here. And so uh, I really want to know uh, where you are in your life. Um, I know for me, uh, when my mom passed away, we did majority of everything together. If you've seen me, you've seen my mom. We were always together. And she passed away. And I had to start over because I really did not know uh, what I really liked, what I really wanted. Um, I had to learn how to go to restaurants by myself. I had to learn how to go to the movies by myself um, and just do different things, go shopping by myself. Um, I remember the first time I went to the restaurant um, that we always went to, uh, I didn't even recognize that I had sit in the same place where we used to sit at. And I just began to cry because I was like, Oh my God, you know, I'm here by myself. And so I really had to figure those things out. I had to take one step at a time to figure out what I want, what I liked. And it doesn't matter the age. Age has nothing to do with it. Um, it's really becoming one with yourself and figuring out um and loving yourself enough to take those steps to begin to learn how to cope and um, live the best life that you can, how to recognize um, that uh, you're not okay to become okay. Recognize that you want better for yourself and so you want to live your best life and you want to take the steps um, and write it down, write it down. You know, like I said, if you have to taste different foods to see what food you like, um, if you have to go different places to see what you like, if you have to um, try on different outfits, um, and, and people take that for granted. We take sometimes when, when the ones that does do have it together, um, they know what they like, they know what they want, um, they are on top of their game. Um, but trust and believe it's something in them as well. They might have all of that together and one thing be out of pocket. Um, and so don't be discouraged and don't look at somebody life else life and compare your life. You are individual, you are loved, you are 
um, amazing. And you have to know that. Um, and so it's time for you to really figure out uh, where you want to go. What do you want to do? Uh, again, do you want to start a business? Um, in this day and time, I believe everybody needs a business. Everybody needs to have um, streams of income, uh, several streams of income in this season. But what do you really want and what do you really like? Do you want to take up sewing? Do you want to uh, start a t-shirt business? Do you want to start a YouTube channel? What is it that you want to do that is going to get you to where you want to go? Uh, we have to get, up, get out of our comfort zones and know that we are worth it. You are worth it. You are worth it. Uh, being loved by yourself, you know, loving yourself enough. Uh, because if you don't love you, no, who else is going to love you? So loving yourself enough to know uh, what you want, what you desire, uh, finding out what your purpose is, uh, finding out uh, the next levels of your life and not just sitting waiting for someone else to figure it out for you. Um, allowing other people to say what you like. Allowing other people to say what you like to eat, what you like to wear, what you um, what you should do when you get up, what you should do when you go to sleep. Um, if it's not their way, it's no way. No, it is your way. This is, you are a human being. You are your own person. You have your own desires. You have your own wants. And so this is your time to do that. And so I encourage you today uh, to start fresh, start anew, and to find out and focus. Focus on what you want to do. Uh, it is very important, it is very imperative that you do so uh, to be able to start making changes in your life. And um, I'm excited for you. I am so excited that uh, you will be starting this journey and I'm so excited to see the journey. Um, I'm also on a journey. You never stop growing. I never stop learning. Um, so we're in this together. Uh, I'm growing as well. I'm making changes as well. Uh, I'm learning uh, what I like, what I don't like. Uh, and you will forever uh, grow in different stages of your life, change and uh, bring newness to uh, to you, you know, uh, grow and uh, fulfill the life that you want. And so I'm excited. I'm excited for the journey. I'm excited um, to see what's going to happen um, and the changes that we are making in our lives to to live our best lives, to live out the life that we so desire and want. And so uh, I thank you for joining my channel today. I thank you. Uh, please subscribe, uh, like, subscribe, and turn on your notification bell so that you will not miss um, any, um, miss any of my content. And I really appreciate you. And uh, I'll see you next time. So have a great day. Bye-bye.